to my channel my name is Tyler Trees I'm back with another video in today's video I just took down my um mini twist if you want to watch that video you definitely can um so yeah I am going to be washing my hair and doing a doing some twists just regular twists for a twist out and not mini twists y'all know I either do a twist out or mini twist those are my two go-to styles that have been growing my hair tremendously um so i am going to be using this dirt be going shampoo that i got from glow and flow this is by honey love organics i got this at the beauty supply store honey um and the brand is called honey love organics i really really love that stuff now i really really love the conditioner the conditioner is definitely the star of the show however i do want to try something out because i went to target last saturday i went to target last saturday and i got this now i normally don't um try new stuff but I was like, I have to try this. Y'all know I don't deep condition. I only use conditioner now. And it has just been a dream. So I got this Suave Lush and Coily Conditioner at Target. And it's just so cute. I love the bottle. The bottle definitely stuck out to me because we don't really see representation like this as far as black girls go. And look at the different shades of black women on here. Like the art just goes crazy. So I was like, I really, really love this just for the bottle. Like I really, really do. And the fact that it's conditioner, it was only four dollars, and it there are it is sixteen ounces of conditioner. I was like, yeah, I could do that. So yeah, I went ahead and splurged. Well, not splurged because it was it was only four dollars. But anyway, um, I also got this Suave Lush and Coily Leave-In Conditioner as well. <clears throat> Excuse me, y'all. So the main thing that I run through is leave-in conditioner, uh, twisting creams, or regular conditioner. So I, that's why I decided to get just these two products. There are other products in the line, but I wanted to get products that I actually needed. So I need some more conditioner, you know what I'm saying? And I also... I didn't need this leave-in, but I wanted to get it. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. So anyways, yeah, it's wash day. I am going to use this Honey Love Organics shampoo. And if that, if this shampoo, if this conditioner doesn't work, I'm going to go in with my Honey Love Organics conditioner. So that's how we're going to do that. So yeah, I will come back to y'all. I am wearing a shirt, if y'all was wondering. But I like wearing these type of shirts because I'm going to get wet anyway. So I might as well just you know yeah okay so i'm finna wash my hair and i'll be right back i'll be right back i'll be right back i'll be right back i love this shampoo bro Ooh, dirt be going shampoo by honey love organics i love this stuff y'all oh my hair feels so nice and clean and it's minty so my hair loves anything minty and i love anything minty as well so this is how my hair looks like fresh out the uh sink freshly washed so yeah it's a little tangly you know what i mean it's a little tangly but it's nice and clean so i fuck with that Okay, so we finna see if this shampoo, I mean, this shampoo, what is it? What is that? Oh, that's dust. I don't know where that came from, but okay. We finna see if this um conditioner is talking about something. You feel me? So. Eh. Eh. That kind of hurt. We finna put this um, conditioner to the test. Because this is the same thing I did with the Honey Love Organics conditioner. And it was working for me. So we finna do the same thing. Okay. And I love that Suave came out with a coily line. Suave's products are normally directed towards Caucasians. Um, so the fact that they came out with a coily line you're where you been at like you took a little too long for my liking but it's here now so i i get it you know what I mean? okay so i am going to section it up and we're just gonna see 
I probably might have to take. Oh, okay, I don't have to take no thing, no thingy off. I don't know if that's good or bad. But yeah, this is the Suave Lush and Coily Conditioner. Oh, she's thick. Oh my God, it smells so good. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, this is worth it. Worth all $5. You know how you put something on and you instantly just know? Oh, yes, ma'am. Wow. Wow. But then again, my hair is easy. Like, my hair, my, I don't know. Like, I, yeah. The way this conditioner made my hair feel is the same way this conditioner is making my hair feel. Yes. Yes. Let's see if we can get the tangle. Oh. <gasps> Look at my <gasps> immediately I approve. And I didn't even use that much. Y'all, this shampoo this um why am I calling it a shampoo? This freaking conditioner by Suave feels so heavenly <gasps> all the look at the oh yes absolutely oh my goodness and it smells so good y'all it smells absolutely divine it smells really really good and i really really like that ow i got water in my eye okay Let's move on to the next session. I'm fucking with this. Oh, I'm fucking with it. Fucking with it. Yeah, yeah. I fuck with it. Look at how it's making my curls. <laughs> now, the only reason I'm going to separate this is because I don't have a defined part. So, I need to add a little bit more hair to this section. Okay, there we go. Y'all, this shit right here. I love this for me. Because y'all know I don't deep condition anymore. So finding good conditioners that work with my hair was so important to me. And I just found two. A cheaper one and a more expensive one. So the Honey Love Organics conditioner is... It's $19.99, which I can pay that. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But then if I don't feel like going to um, the beauty supply store, I can go right down to Target and get this one for $4. I love the way. Oh, my goodness. And I will invest in some good conditioners because I don't deep condition anymore. I don't mind. Paying $19.99 for a damn conditioner. I do that anyway. You feel me? Oh, yes. Look at how defined it's making my curls. And I do like to give y'all options as well. Because I know that not everybody has my specific hair type. So, um... I know one of these is going to work for you. <laughs> one of these is going to work for you. Either the Honey Love Organics is going to work for you or this swab is going to work for you. But one of these is going to work for you. Look at 
how we ciao all right all right you showing out girl for real you showing out showing out today but all right y'all so that is how this conditioner is working i really really love it it feels super super good look at how it just and this is how you know your hair likes something if there is no whiteness and your hair is just absorbing the product that's how you know your hair loves it okay i knew instantly when i put this on my scalp i was like yeah i mean not my scalp but i knew instantly when i put this on my hair i was like yeah because you just know for example when i use that um not there isn't too much stuff that doesn't work for my hair but that um camille rose honey leave-in conditioner the second i put it on my hair i knew it, i knew it wasn't it was a no <laughs> the second i put it on my hair i knew it was a no but i still went through with that wash day and i had to i regretted it because yeah when you are natural and you've been natural for a minute the second you put something on your hair you should be able to tell like okay this is a yes this is a no um and this is a hell yes that honey love organics is a hell yes so and also make sure you get the inside of your hair as well because you see how this has conditioner and this doesn't yeah that's a problem but yeah i take my conditioning very very seriously um if you have a if your conditioner is not moisturizing and you feel like you have to deep condition you should get a different conditioner because yeah because for me my shampoo is supposed to strip i don't want a moisturizing shampoo i want my shampoo to cleanse my scalp i want my shampoo to um clean my hair I can go in with a good conditioner and get that moisture back in. That's what conditioner is for. That's what it's made for. I don't want my shampoo to be moisturizing. Like, no. <laughs> you feel me? That's why conditioner was made in the first place. There's a reason why shampoo was made and there's a reason why conditioner was made. Shampoo was made to clean your scalp. Conditioner is made to put that moisture back into your scalp. So, yes, I don't want my shampoo to be moisturizing. I want you to do its job. I want you to do your job. You know what I mean? Y'all, this conditioner is heavenly. Yes. Oh, my goodness. I fuck with it. I fuck with it. I fuck with it. I fuck with it. Look at how it's just laying my roots down. I fuck with this so much. Oh my goodness. Y'all just don't know. All right, y'all. So I'm going to do the other side. And then I'm going to come back to y'all with the um, leave-in conditioner when I wash this out. <sighs> right now I'm conditioning. Um, and the reason why I have my hot head on is because I had a protective style in. So I want to give my hair that good TLC without um, actually buying a deep conditioner. So this right here, y'all absolutely amazing i really really love it i love it so 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 much this suave lush and coily um moisturizing conditioner i love it okay i really really love it they really really knew what they was doing and it says it's co-created with it's co-created with natural with women with natural hair so i already knew it was gonna be bomb i really really like this product um definitely going to continue to buy my honey love organics conditioner and this i don't need any more i don't need to try any more options and i thought it was gonna be so hard trying all these damn conditioners and shit but i found two that i love so this these is gonna be staples <laughs> so if i'm not using honey love organics conditioner i'm using this um As you heard, my food is done in a microwave. So yeah, I'm just going to leave this on, my hot head on, 
and I am going to come back to y'all because like I said I did have a protective style so I do want to make sure that I give my hair that TLC without a buying a deep conditioner regular conditioner is definitely where it's at um and I absolutely love this and I love the smell of it too both of them honey love organics it gives me that mint tingly sensation and then this one is just so wonderful and moisturizing so yeah all right that washout that washout was heavenly <gasps> my hair feels so look at my hair <laughs> it feels so good oh my god okay so i am going to do a staples video because um yeah i am definitely going to do a staples video my hair feels so heavenly my hair feels so heavenly oh my goodness my hair feels so good and i only shampooed and conditioned i did go in with my hot head because like i said i had a protective style in and you know what i'm saying i wanted my hair to be nice and moisturized so i am going to um do my part like over here because i don't want to do my part too much in the center anymore um, I need a, uh, yeah, I don't want to do my part too much in the center, so we're just going to do it, like, over here. Because I seen this girl on TikTok, she was balding, and that's not going to be me, because she did one part every single time she did her hair. So yeah, we're just gonna move the part. Bam. I feel like that's too much of a... I still want it to look like it's a middle part though. Cause I don't like side parts anymore. I used to love side parts, but... Yo, my hair feels so good. Oh my goodness. Okay, yeah, that works. That's not the middle. Like, if you... That is not the middle. <laughs> that is not the middle at all. But it's fine. Um, Like I said, I don't want to do middle parts. Because I need to give my middle part a break. You know what I'm saying? We not trying to go bald, Okay. But yes, y'all, stay tuned for my staples video because I want to show y'all my staple hair products. Actually, you know what? I need to wait. I need to wait. Well, you know what? You know what? Okay, I'm going to do a part two. I'm going to do a part two because I don't even have some of my staples that are actually staples. But um, yeah. Okay, you know this is going to piss you off. You already know. I don't even know why you did it. But yeah, y'all, if you just find a couple of products that are your staples and you use those products and you stick to them, your hair growth journey should be a good one. It should be fine. All right, y'all. So the moment of truth, I am going to go in with the Suave and Lush and Coily Leave-In Conditioner. Hopefully, this does right by me. If not, I mean, we can go back to using Old Faithful, which is Melanin Hair Care. Y'all, I don't even have any product in my hair, and I can... Look at this. Oh, yes, ma'am. I am... I don't have any product in my hair. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so we're just going to use the top. So, it is um watery. It is watery, so you can see, like, yeah. <gasps> yes. Yes. Going with the inside of my hair. 
<gasps> yes. Oh, yes. Y'all. It feels so good. I love the consistency of this product. Oh my goodness, y'all, my wash days lately have been absolutely bomb. And the product is buildable. <gasps> yes, ma'am. I have been loving my wash days lately. Um, and it's because I'm using decent products. Oh my goodness. I had I thought my my wash days was decent before but ever since I found Melanie hair care and Camille Rose and just good hair products that work for me my wash days have been insane look at that beautiful oh it just feels like butter look at that twist oh and I'm getting the roots good. Y'all, I'm definitely going to do a staples video. Staple hair products. Stay tuned for it. Stay tuned for it. Because I got something to say, God damn it. Yes, I do. Yes, ma'am, I do. I already know this twist out is going to be bomb because look at how my hair just absorbs the product. I know for a fact this twist out is going to be bomb. And then just twist the ends. It looks so juicy and just... Stop playing with me. that around oh my goodness stop playing with me y'all stop playing i need some clips but i don't feel like getting up and i'm already recording so this is gonna be look at how And this is also good because I don't have to try anything else. Y'all know I have—I I only try stuff once in a blue moon. I am still a Melanie Hair Care fan. Um, but I try new stuff here and there. Like I said, I had to get this brand because the packaging is what definitely sold me. And the ingredients on the bottle as well. My hair really meshes well with coconut oil and shea butter. So... I knew I was going to like it because my hair loves coconut oil and shea butter. So it's really a no brainer when you, like I said, when you find out what, pro, what, um, ingredients your hair loves, your wash day will be simpler and easier. Find out the consistencies that your hair loves as well. Like you're going to be good. Oh my goodness. And then your hair will go because if you're sticking to the same stuff your hair is already used to, your hair has no choice but to grow. Especially if you're not being rough with your hair either. Look at the child that definition go crazy crazy you hear me that definition goes crazy so just learn what type of ingredients your hair loves learn um what type of styling tools your hair loves it's it's it really is a hair journey like it really is a hair journey because you have to learn what your hair likes and doesn't like, the ingredients, styling tools. Like, you have to learn a lot. But once you do, your hair is going to flourish, I promise you.
and as long as you're not being too rough with it make sure you're being gentle i really cannot understand how some girls are like oh my god i hate my natural hair i don't like it it's this it's that it's like girl your natural hair is beautiful no matter what the hair type i love my natural hair because it's mine it's literally a hair that grows out of my head how can i hate that look at that curl i'm not even big on curl definition i really could care less as long as i don't have any type of damage i don't really care about defined curls um but it's nice that this is actually defining my curls it's really really nice i'm really gonna fuck around about the whole line honestly look at that stop my twist looks so juicy They look so juicy. And like I said, my hair is absorbing the product. There is no white. Because of the consistency of the products. Y'all, I think I did my big one. If I do say so myself. If I do say so myself, I think I did my big one. So after I get done with this section, I'll come back to y'all. Well, this will be the end of my video. Actually, no, I won't. I'm so undecisive. But y'all love me for it. I love how I can post videos in my real and raw form and not get judged for it. Like, I really love y'all for that. And I don't think I've ever said that. Like, y'all just my homegirls and we just sitting doing our hair together. I really like that. Whether you're old or whether you're new, whether you are 25 or 67, if you fuck with me and you fuck with my channel and you fuck with my content, thank you so, so much. Thank you so much. Um, especially if you're a OG and you've been watching me grow and you've been watching my channel since I had like 24 subscribers, like, I appreciate you so much. Y'all really don't know how much this means a lot to me. For me to have a platform, for me to voice my opinion how I do, for me to just get on here and do what I do, it's really a blessing and I truly love it. And I am forever grateful. I don't even have 100K yet. I don't even have 24K yet. But I am forever grateful. Like, this is very humbling. <laughs> Somebody told me they were like, um, I love how humble you are. Like, you're a humble, you really are a humble YouTuber. And I'm just like, thank you. That's what I really strive to be. I never want to forget, like, when I had three subscribers or when I had 24, you know what I'm saying? Um, I never want to forget that. Because now look at me, monetized. I don't have that many subscribers, you know what I'm saying? But compared to other people, but that's why I don't compare myself to other people. Because I have a platform where people fuck with me and people love my content and people love what I have to say and people actually want to hear what I have to say. You know what I'm saying? 
and that means the world to me. A little girl from Georgia. Just doing her thing. And if you have ever followed a natural hair tip, I fuck with you, right? Because you're actually trusting me. You know what I'm saying? You're actually trusting my judgment. I fuck with you. And I don't take that lightly. I'm not out here just doing sponsorships just to get the checks. You understand what I'm saying? If it's not working for me, it don't work. If it don't work, it don't work. You feel me? Everything that I have ever put on my channel has worked for me. Now, whether my hair changed, that's a different story. But I've never once lied and said, oh... I don't like this or I've never I mean I've never once lied and said oh yeah this worked for me and it really didn't you know what I'm saying um so yeah y'all look at how shiny my hair is it's really coming along nicely all right y'all so I will come back when my hair is all done and finished and twisted up and i will chop it up with y'all but so far so freaking good so yeah try the ends make them real curly bam look at that all right I'm going to come back. All right, y'all. I'm chilling right now. My wash day was absolutely successful. Look at my twist. Really, really nice and juicy. Um, I really enjoyed my wash day. And that's the thing. You're supposed to enjoy your wash day. It's not supposed to feel like it's a hassle. The second, it feel like, the second your wash day feels like a hassle, you're doing something wrong. You know what I'm saying? Because if you don't enjoy your wash day, are you going to really treat your hair good? exactly no so yes my wash day is over my twists are nice and juicy and my hair is literally almost dry which is amazing because when you have healthy hair your hair is going to dry faster so um yeah i'm going to come back on and do a untwist reveal and things like that so stay tuned for that video thank you guys so much for watching don't forget to like comment subscribe make sure you follow me on instagram my instagram is kyla latrice make sure you follow my tiktok my tiktok is kyla latrice 98 and make sure you follow my backup tiktok my backup is kyla latrice 99 and i'll see y'all in my next video peace